Today we'll be taking a look at MMAC, Juan Soriano Museum in Cuernavaca, Mexico. Juan Soriano was a famous Mexican artist known for his paintings and sculpture. Later in the video we'll have a look at the garden behind the museum, which houses many of his sculptures. But first, we'll take a look at the current exhibition titled Gastronomic. Gastronomic is a show curated by Mexican artist Cisco Jimenez and consists of 30 contemporary artists vastly ranging in age and style, many of which are from or live in Cuernavaca. This right here is one of my favorite works of art in the show. It's a mixed media painting by contemporary artist Lalo Lugo. The title of the painting is El Mole Verde and incorporates oil and acrylic on linen and casulla, which is an ancient religious garment. The painting is one of the last paintings that Lugo made in 2023. And here we have a wooden sculpture by Cisco Jimenez. It's made out of wood, but it also has different materials and is painted on the front. Cisco Jimenez is from Cornavaca, and if you recall, he's the one who curated this exhibition. And turning around, we have an incredible sculpture by American artist Ray Smith who spends a lot of his time in Cuernavaca. Sorry, one moment. And then as we leave the main gallery showroom to enter into the next gallery, we see a large painting by Pamela Zubiaga from 2023. And continuing through the hallway to the next gallery space, there's a large sculpture installation by Gabriela De Solbi from 2023 as well. The work incorporates found kitchen objects such as bottles of wine and tea kettles, which are covered in beeswax. The aim of the artist in her practice is to create a direct link between art and science, often incorporating beekeeping. And here we have a fantastic little painting by Daniel Azama, who is from Mexico City, but currently works out of Cornavaca as well. And he's one of the top living artists in Mexico today. And now we enter the incredible garden behind the museum, or I guess it depends which way you enter the museum. But if you're entering through the front of the museum, this garden is in the back, but you can also enter through the garden on the other side of the property. And if you remember in the beginning of the video, I said that the museum was named after Juan Soriano, who was in a Mexican artist and sculptor. This is the place that has a lot of his sculptures kind of hidden throughout the, the garden, but it's a in really incredible space and it's free to enter. And I also forgot to mention that the exhibition we just took a look at was free to enter even for foreigners, so we didn't have to pay anything. Thank you so much for watching. 
please consider subscribing if you want to see more videos like this and learn about more contemporary artists and museums.